Just a love, just a love, just a love, just a love. Yo, what's up YouTube, it's Garrison here and welcome back to the channel. So today I'll be checking out Chunga's MV for Bicycle. Now I'm all hyped up here as the wait is finally over, right? And at the same time, I do know that this song comes along with her first studio album, by the way. Some of y'all may know, 21 tracks it goes crazy i heard some audio snippets here and there but aside from that haven't seen all the teasers i do know that this uh first studio album includes her previous releases of course x a dream of you stay tonight play we love to see it though changa is here with bicycle but before we really get into this i just gotta say i really admire changa okay in case y'all didn't know she is one of my top favorite artists out there in the scene who's been killing it i've seen her ever since the ioi days the early days and seeing her really progress and really show what she's all about as a solo artist and collab with others and have her peak moment with gotta go and just go crazy with all of her releases i really admire her as a solo artist okay but enough talk let's just get into it shall we all right changa bicycle i got the english captions on and all let's go Oh. Oh my. <laughs> I definitely wasn't expecting a start like this. Ooh. Where's this going? That hits hard with the brass sounds. Oh, loving the attitude that I'm hearing right now from Chunga and Sian, of course. Hold up. <laughs> No way! Stop! 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 Someone should have warned me. Rap versus she, Changa be spinning her lines right here. Oh my goodness, Changa and rap. What? Hold up. Sorry, I gotta bring this back. I rarely pause and stuff, but let's just bring it back, okay? Wow. Yes. Loving how upbeat this song is. The impact that Chunga has in this. the visuals of course throughout all these scenes the lyrics though that queen mentality of course Loving the percussion sounds here, though. Okay. 
with the dance break? Love the drums here. Wow. The ad libs here. Yes, Chana, get it. Boom, boom. <laughs> wow, this is super catchy. Oh my goodness. This is one hell of a song. Um, Like I said earlier, I didn't expect a start like that to this song. But I think after seeing and watching this whole thing and listening to this whole thing by Chang'e, Bicycle and all, I wasn't expecting this period from Chang'e stylistically and in terms of the genre that she utilized uh, for this, okay? Um, right away, before I forget it, I feel like this reminds me of mainstream uh, music that we're seeing from the Western scene, of course. Um, reminds me of what... Um, Ariana Grande would put out okay Chang'e coming out with that badass mentality we love to see it although I feel like when it comes to songs that have that badass mentality it is hit or miss um, for me I'm picky uh, for um, these type of songs now Bicycle I feel like it I can listen to it okay I, I can see myself listening to it but however I'm not sure about the longevity of it, to it, and in, lo in terms of longevity, I mean, how much am I going to listen to this song in the long run if I'm going to keep this song on repeat, um, but of course, mind you, this is the first listen of it, my first listen, so it, it, it will probably grow on me after a couple listens, several uh, listens, and all but aside from that where do i even begin with this song let's talk about the mv first visuals all around amazing cinematography from start to finish especially during the dance break with the pool of water and Chang'e ascending uh, her with the backup dancers in the final chorus so good um and of course that leads to her lyrics the badass mentality the queen mentality with her lyrics you know how she's above, everyone's lower than her. You know, she's the best, she's the queen. Um, no one can really get stooped to her, um, you know, level. She's on different levels. And I think um, that's really clear with her music that we've been seeing from Chang'e and hearing from Chang'e ever since the start. Okay, let me talk a bit about me and following Chang'e from the start from my notice. Ever since her debut, her solo debut, she worked with Timorio to really establish that uh, sound. And then she really branched off with several producers and such when she really, really peaked and spiked, of course, with Gotta Go. Has to be my all-time favorite title track song by Chang'e to date, of course. My personal favorite. I'm not sure about you guys. Let me know your personal favorite uh, title track by Chang'e. Is it Bicycle or is it a different one in the comment section down below? But really, seeing her branch out, collab with other artists within Korea and outside Korea is just super phenomenal. And then her working heavily uh with vicenzo in case y'all didn't know i do recall um after seeing the track listing vicenzo worked on this track who has um done a play uh and also stay tonight uh with Chang'e, and then also uh daniel kim uh daniel kim has worked on this track in case y'all don't know uh, daniel kim has worked with mcnd worked with drippin worked with EXO in the past couple of years uh, back with Luna. So really working with notable artists. Um, also Vicenzo as well, you know, which I believe a long time ago, a while back uh, with G-Friend. Um, also, of course, with um, Bandit, a Bandit under the same label, MNH Entertainment, of course, Children and such. Um, but I feel like 
they really went a different uh, path and Chunga has a lot of influence in terms of what she is putting out these days and I think Bicycle really adds to her path you know branching on on into the western scene and breaking out through and I think that really adds to it of course with Dream of You such an amazing collab with Rehab of course a song that I can that I really have been really keeping in my rotation these days and throughout my playlist but Bicycle okay back to talking about Bicycle Bicycle I need to say it right away really overwhelming super unexpected but not in a bad way of course I feel like that the unexpected rap lines her spitting out rap verses added a lot to the song and really shows another side to Chang'e okay we've seen Chang'e really work ballad songs really work upbeat songs and also songs that have other influences from other uh, genres of course which is clearly evident uh, throughout her past releases such as play featuring uh, Changmo and some such. but for bicycle yeah it it really reminds me of uh, the songs that we've been hearing in the western scene about king or queen mentality badass mentality um like what ariana grande would put out of course choreo absolutely phenomenal but going back to for me is stylistically it's not my all-time favorite title track um, as of right now for me upon first listen and that's really just due to compared to what I've heard from Chang'e in the past and um, what she has done in terms of the lyrics department and in terms of in terms of the soundscape of her songs okay don't get me wrong there's a lot of texture to this song um, percussion added percussion instruments added layers with her you know of course her ad libs in the final chorus and such but I think th the one thing that really keeps this song going is how catchy it is okay the broom 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 let's admit it it's it's an earworm and a half of course it's definitely a bop but Going back to what I said earlier on, the longevity to it, I'm worried about that, okay? I can't, I don't see myself right away listening to this song on repeat, but I can see myself listening to it. Um, Gotta Go it has been a song that I can been keeping on repeat. Dream of You, I've been keeping on repeat, and that's just due to the unexpected um, moments, you know, that's not too over the top. Of course, she has her grandio um, type songs, of course, but this really goes to show us you know this is another title track that i've seen from other artists right as well as that really gives another flavor another taste another side to certain artists and in this case bicycle and Chang'e, it shows her badass side of course and i know i could see see i could see some people liking a certain part in the song and not liking a certain part in the song personally for me the rap verses of course the rap verses and especially the dance break um and yeah let me know how you felt about Chang'e's song bicycle i'm sure that um the b-sides will go hard i'm curious i'm really curious of that one b-side featuring cold um i i'm a huge fan of cold and his um music and such but yeah bicycle really great uh song i'd have to say and definitely the finale that we've been really waiting and looking for uh, performance wise and all and how in your face attitude she really brought to the table but let me know how y'all thought about bicycle is it your favorite song to date can you keep it on repeat um let me know if you've heard her first studio album by the way i'm really hyped out to check out those b-sides and all this has been garrison though be sure to like share and maybe subscribe as it really really helps out the channel it just warms my heart being able to connect with fellow fans and talk about Chang'e and all take care have a great day have a good night have a good afternoon as always take care it's crazy out there please stay safe promise me that and peace